Gwen and Judy, thank you very much for hosting this event, and PBS, thank you. Nine months ago, uh, our campaign began. And when it began, uh, we had no political organization, no money, and not much name recognition outside of the state of Vermont. A lot has happened in nine months. And what has happened is I think the American people have responded to a series of basic truths. And that is that we have today a campaign finance system which is corrupt, which is undermining American democracy, which allows Wall Street and billionaires to pour huge sums of money into the political process to elect the candidates of their choice. And aligned with a corrupt campaign finance system is a rigged economy. And that's an economy where ordinary Americans are working longer hours for lower wages. They're worried to death about the future of their kids. And yet they are seeing almost all new income and all new wealth going to the top 1%. And then in addition to that, the American people are looking around and they see a broken criminal justice system. They see more people in jail in the United States of America than any other country on earth. 2.2 million. We're spending $80 billion a year locking up fellow Americans. They see kids getting arrested for marijuana, getting a prison, getting a criminal record, while they see executives on Wall Street who pay billions of dollars in settlements and get, get no prosecution at all. No criminal records for them. I think what our campaign is indicating is that the American people are tired of establishment politics, tired of establishment economics. They want a political revolution in which millions of Americans stand up come together, not let the Trumps of the world divide us, and say, you know what, in this great country, we need a government that represents all of us, not just a handful of wealthy campaign contributors. Thank you. Thank you, Senator Sanders.